Ni hao, wish is Stephanie. Look at me, I'm in Nanjing again. All right, not a very sexy view today. I'm so sorry. Just an average city view. Eh, it happens. <laughs> okay, so I just want to do a quick update video. I did not have time this morning after my morning study to tell you how I did. I did okay. Not as great as some other days. I decided to experiment and I thought, oh, I can multitask. I can actually do the first two of the three items with my phone in its phone stand on the edge of the bath as I take a bath because I can get ready for work and do this at the same time. And if this works out, I don't have to wake up early. I can just have this as part of my get ready time. And the answer to that is, did it work? Did it work? No, <laughs> I did get the things done. The two of the three things that I wanted to do. What were those two things? The Anki flashcards for the radicals. I did one small round of HSK and um, which was honestly, I think like five words. It wasn't even a lot. I need to up how many I'm doing per day there. It's really boring to do five. Um, and the uh, the pinion practice, the pinion trainer. So I did get those two done, but the edge of this bathtub was the smallest that I've had in any hotel, and I felt like my phone was going to fall off the edge onto the floor or into the bath, and that's just not worth saving 20 minutes over. <laughs> or tw Yeah, about 20 minutes over. So that did not work out great. I did get both of those done, but then I also got a little too relaxed and almost didn't make it to breakfast before work. So I don't think I'll be repeating that for studying purposes. Um, but it was worth a try. You never know what works, what routine would work. And I definitely couldn't do that at home because we don't have a bathtub. We have a shower, which is uh, more the norm here. So yeah, so I tried that, but I did get two of the three done. I didn't get the graded reader done. Um, uh, today and honestly the next two days just get busier so I'm gonna bring it to work and we'll see if I have any downtime at all and if so I'll trudge along or I'll try tomorrow morning if I wake up and don't repeat today's madness um, but there's that so I still got some stuff done today and I actually have a craving for more vocab so I might come back after dinner and do one more round of Anki tonight um, yeah so I still I have this chewing, chewing? What? I have this sensation in my head where I want to absorb more. So I think I'm going to do that. Or maybe I'll do some of the grammar apps that I have, but I definitely want more today. That did not satiate me at all. The graded reader definitely challenges me to the point where I'll think about studying more, but not necessarily do it. And since I didn't do that this morning, I definitely want more. Um, what else? What else? What else? Oh, um, uh, Somebody in Shanghai saw me, uh, saw my channel, saw my graded reader, mm, my ideal graded reader video, and sent me, haha, -ha, a different graded reader that does have yes, the Hans, Hans, and the Pinion. And so uh, I copy and pasted that into my um, my uh, Bao Pals, which is the English version of Taobao that I hope to at some point stop using, and. Um, and ordered it, so it should be there by the time I get back to Shanghai on Friday. That wobbling is intentional because I'm bouncing up and down because I'm super excited. I would thank the person, but I'm not really sure that they want their name mentioned in this video. So thank you very much. You know who you are. Um, <laughs> anyway, so I have a new graded reader coming. If that proves to work out a lot better than this one, I may abandon this one and go straight with just those stories. It looks like a compilation. I didn't read the description too much. It sounded like a great recommendation and it was super cheap. So I just, I don't, and I don't have a, time, a lot of time to research this week. So I just bought it, frivolously bought it. It was maybe $4, $5. And it looked like a bunch of different uh, stories. So I'm super excited about that. I may abandon this one, I may not. Again, I'm sort of attached to the story of what I think this graded reader is about, so I may still trudge on with it just in a slightly different way. I don't know, I don't know. I know I could just look up the story and read it in English, but I kinda like what I'm doing with this. We shall see what happens. I'm adaptable, 
I am adaptable and I am super excited. I also got another recommendation from Japan Kofun on YouTube and in comments in a previous video for another graded reader. Um, that was through Amazon though and I need to double check and see if I can get that on, on Baopals or Taobao or JD.com or any of the local ones here. I don't know if I can get that in China yet but I will research that as well. Thank you very much for that recommendation. I super appreciate recommendations. I kind of just went into the bookstore and said, this looks nice, this looks nice, I'll try this, and didn't realize what I needed at the time. And now I don't have time to go back to a bookstore until early September, early September. And then I'll have tons of time. Oh my God, the study time I'm gonna have in September looks so good right now. I just keep staring at my calendar going, oh, September's nice. Not only will I reap the benefits of working this much in August, um, in September, but I'll have tons of study time too. So I will get coffee after coffee after coffee at the coffee shop and continue studying, studying, studying. Oh, I had this idea today that it might be time for a tutor instead of a class. I like the idea of an online class, but I also like the idea of an online tutor. I don't know if I can do anything in person. My travel schedule is a little too crazy. So I think that might be unrealistic and hectic and it would be more travel around Shanghai, which is a nightmare to get around a lot of the times. So I think maybe a tutor is a way to go. I have a referral on somebody who comes to your home. How can I resist that? I do need to double check that they'll be okay with focusing on reading and writing. Um, of course, they'll be speaking involved in it, but primarily reading and writing. So I need to make sure, again, that they're comfortable with my personal goals personal language learning goals. Some people like teaching the way they know because they want to get people up to a certain level in what they're familiar with teaching. And I totally get that. Recreating the wheel as a teacher is a nightmare and not really financially feasible either. So I respect it. I just don't want to learn what somebody else wants me to learn right now. I want to learn what I want to learn. I'm being totally goofy. Sorry, that was way too much of a a bed hotel shop. Ah! Okay, I'm feeling really wired today. I had a coffee at two or three o'clock in the afternoon, which is a really, it's a recipe for disaster. Anyway, I wanted to share the good news about the graded readers and what I did this morning. And I'm super excited. I didn't really think I would get a lot of studying done this week, but adding the morning study, the morning study is really helping with all of that. So I am super duper duper excited. And I almost guarantee you that on Friday, I'm not going to get anything done because instead of waking up at six, I will need to actually, I've been waking up at 530 in the morning. If you knew how much of a night owl I am, you'd know how painful that is. But um, Friday, we're leaving to go to work at 7 a.m. Ah! So I seriously doubt, although it's a, it's a long ride, so maybe I'll get stuff done um, during the ride. Maybe I'll do that then. We shall see. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel for this week's work and I'm super excited about that. I'm super excited about everything. I think that's my new phrase or I've been using that for weeks and weeks and weeks. Anyway, thank you all for all your support and all your suggestions. And um, I have some other videos that are coming up soon, but just not today and not now. Thank you very much. Woo! More soon. That's the end.